Here at Moda One, we strive to bring you important consumer advice that you can use, which is why I'm here to tell you that the Jeep Grand Cherokee Trackhawk that's debuting at the New York Auto Show should be your next family vehicle. What I mean by that is that it guarantees that you'll never be late to a PTA meeting or soccer practice ever again, because under this hood, it's got the supercharged engine from a Dodge Challenger and Charger Hellcat. The engine makes so much power that it sucks in a thousand cubic feet of air per minute at full throttle, necessitating this extra air slit here up front in the fascia, as well as vents in the hood to keep the engine cool. Just like in the Dodge Charger and Challenger Hellcats, the engine in the Trackhawk is a 6.2 liter supercharged V8. It makes the same 707 horsepower as in those cars, the 645 pound-feet of torque. That's five pound-feet less than the other ones, but who's counting? It's also still backed up to an eight-speed automatic transmission, but unlike those cars, it's got all-wheel drive as standard. And should you run into an unexpected school zone along the way, it's got big Brembo brakes to slow you down. In fact, the biggest brakes the Jeep has ever put on a production vehicle. In addition to the Trackhawk badge, you can tell that this is a serious performance SUV by the black quad exhausts. The really crazy wide tires, these are 295 45s in the back on 20 inch wheels. In fact, they're so wide that they need new fender flares to fit over them. But the thing is, you can use this Grand Cherokee Trackhawk all year round. You can still seat five people. It's still got a roomy cargo area in back. It comes with all wheel drivers standard with a snow mode, and you can still hitch up and tow 7,200 pounds so you can take your boat to the lake in summer. One of the coolest things about this Hellcat engine, besides the fact that it makes 707 horsepower, is that Dodge wants to make sure everyone's gonna work to its maximum potential. So after building them, Dodge puts it on a dyno to test it for 42 minutes before stuffing it in this engine bay. So if you're running late to soccer practice, your kids are gonna have plenty of space to sit back here, but you might not want to drive too quickly because you don't want them to vomit all over this lovely red leather seating. But ultimately, this is where you want to be in the track hall. Behind the wheel with the paddle shifters, the launch control button, ready to test out just how close to that 180 mile an hour top speed you can get, even if you've got four other passengers on board. Okay, so a minivan might be a slightly more practical choice if you're just looking for a family vehicle. But what I love about the Trackhawk is it can do it all. It can drive 180 miles an hour and hit racetracks. It can tow, it can pull your family along, and it can drive through snow with all-wheel drive. That's why I think it's one of the coolest things that we've seen here at the New York Auto Show.